I want y'all to keep it going, keep the energy going. From Earthquake La LOL Network, y'all show some love for Mario Hunt! How y'all doing? Good? <laughs> Good to see y'all, man. I'm from Oakland, California. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, a, I'm, I'm, a, I'm 50 years old, you guys. I'll tell y'all the truth. Yeah. I was raised right. I got morals. I don't cuss around my mother. I don't disrespect my mother. I don't do none of that. I'm still scared of my mother. You know what I'm saying? I come from that era where, the, where your mothers didn't play that, play that shit. You know, so... Today, I still don't cuss around my mother, don't do none of that. My mother is my friend on Facebook. Like, I wrote something on Facebook the other day, she came on there and chastised me. She's like, I didn't raise you like that, you don't cuss at black women like that. You know, I'm not gonna, like I said, I'm not gonna disrespect my mama, but I was smart. I went to a different page and came back as a different person. <laughs> and came back and was like, listen here, old bitch, you need to mind your motherfucking business. I'm a fan of Mario Hodge, you need to leave him the fuck alone, lay your old ass down somewhere. I had to let that old bitch know. She gonna inbox me talking about, you need to delete that nigga. <laughs> they hiring anybody in Walmart, they don't give a fuck. You know the motherfuckers that check your receipts? When you leave, they don't give a fuck who they hired. They hired a nigga in a hospital bed. This nigga. I'm like, this nigga in a hospital bed. I had to ask that nigga. I'm like, blood, why you at work? He like, nigga, I ran out of sick days. <laughs> nigga had to go to work. My partner just died. Yeah, he was a midget. That was the shortest funeral service I ever been to. <laughs> that funeral was like eight minutes long, nigga. He had a little ass casket. If we and you die, we got like eight, to eight like six to eight par bearers. This nigga only had one par bearer. They carried that nigga like a bag of groceries. <laughs> He wanted to be cremated, they put that nigga in an air fryer. <laughs> Y'all going to hell for laughing at that shit. <laughs> Ladies, real quick. No disrespect to y'all, but if you got a big ass forehead, stop wearing lace front wigs. They not for you. I'm just gonna show you how you look in public to everybody else. Shit. <laughs> look how you look sideways when you driving. Look at your forehead. When you... Stop posting pictures on Facebook sideways. Your face is on Facebook, your forehead on Instagram, bitch. And ladies, wear makeup to the point your dog will remember you when you get back home. Your dog shouldn't be barking at you when you get to the gate. And stop wearing your hair in a ponytail at the top if you ain't got no edges, bitch. Why is your fake eyelashes longer than your edges? That's a problem. You look embarrassing with that ponytail on top of your head, no edges. Let me just show you. Shit. Look how stupid your ass look. Then y'all be trying to be slick and like moving to the side like. Ah, <laughs> oh, bitch, you bald head. Oh, he's telling me you got alopecia. You an ala lie, bitch. An ala lie. All you bitches ain't got alopecia. 
I hate them young women too. I don't fuck with young women that's 35 and under. Y'all attitude in your pussy is the same. Yep, if, you're, if you got attitude, your pussy got attitude too. I'm 50 years old, I nut quick. It's over. Quick. I have a sex with this young girl, nutted, her pussy did like this. <laughs> I said, is your pussy lips just smack? Bitch, pussy upset. What <laughs> shit is that? I don't fuck with you young women, man. 35 and I can't fuck with y'all. I don't have the patience. My eyes are different now. I, I need reading glasses, certain shit I can't see. Y'all be having all them tattoos all over your body. Take your clothes off, you look like scratch paper. I'm getting busy with this 35 year old girl, right? She got the tramp stamp at the bottom of her back. I'm looking at it, I'm hitting it. I'm thinking the whole time it say caramel, right? I put my reading glasses on, that shit said cash app. <laughs> I, I ain't about to pay for no pussy, man, I'm sorry. And I'm 50. Anybody know that you're 50? We need complete silence when we having sex. Or they'll throw us the fuck off and we gotta restart. Yes. Turn the goddamn TV off when I'm fucking. I don't wanna hear nothing. Or they throw me off. I'm fucking, and one of them stupid ass commercials come on, throw me off. Nationwide is on your side. Then oh. this young girl tell me, come, come, come through. Come through, I'm gonna give you the best head you ever had in your life. I said, okay, cool, I'll come through. Come in the house, she, she on me, giving me head but I, my dick keep going soft. She said, what's the problem? I said, it ain't you. Change your goddamn batteries in your smoke detector, bitch. All I kept hearing was deep, deep, deep. I can't nut off that. I don't like skinny women either. Ladies, if you ain't got no ass and titties, you should be able to park in handicapped parking spaces. That's a disability. I went to the movies with this skinny bitch. She's so light in the ass. We was watching the movie, her seat kept popping up the whole motherfucking time. I had to put my popcorn in the drink and this bitch lapped so her legs could stay down. I like a BBW. I love a BBW. I took my big girl to the movie. She got up to use the bathroom. Her seat stayed the fuck down till she got back. She fucked up all the screws in that seat. We had to take it with us. And that's the car seat for me, for my son. <laughs> Ladies, quit worry about your goddamn gut. Fuck these men. He, yeah, a man gonna love you. Yeah, I'm serious though. Fuck these men. Love yourself from head to toe. These motherfuckers telling you how you supposed to look. Shame on them niggas. <laughs> <laughs> Love your gut. I made a slogan for you if you got a problem with your gut, if you insecure, ladies. What is it? A gut don't stop a nut. Missionary style, them titties and that stomach is jiggling at the same goddamn time. That's like a four goddamn titties at once. That's beautiful. Any vegans in here? Can't stand vegans. Fuck y'all. I dated a vegan before all she ate was nuts and berries. I ate a pussy that tastes like trail mix. I got that shit somewhere else. That trailer. And them young girls are, wait a minute, I just looked over to see my wife, she's sitting with another nigga. I didn't even know I was in a poly relationship. She young, she young, she 10 years younger than me. You can't even give young women a compliment. You ever walk up to the young women, you be like, how you doing, queen? She, Get out of my face, fuck nigga with them smart and final jeans on. I'm like, God damn. 
Smart and final. God damn, them grocery outlet shoes on, nigga. They clown the fuck out of you, them old. Them, them. I like a. What, what are 40 and over women? Any 40 and over women in here? Thank you, thank you, sister. Y'all the best women ever, man. I like some titties that been through some shit. Woo! Love them titties, boy. They be smooth, flat, long. Take them out in LA, them motherfuckers roll to Oakland. <laughs> I don't go over 55 when it comes to women, though, because that's when y'all start forgetting shit. Can't remember shit. Start forgetting shit. I'm, I'm fucking with this 60-year-old lady. She butt naked. I'm tearing that ass up. She peeling potatoes while I'm hitting it, right? She butt naked with some knee highs on. No. I'm tearing that ass up. You know, we start talking shit. I'm like, what's my goddamn name, huh? What's my name? She gonna turn around and say, tell me again, sugar, I forgot. <laughs> I said, you old bitch. I had to get rid of that bit. I was tired of watching Judge Mathis every day anyway. <laughs> Music has changed now. Any Erica Badu fans in here? Yeah. That's one of my favorite singers, but I can't understand what the fuck she be saying sometimes. <laughs> Listen to Love of My Life. She don't be saying shit. This is all I heard. I hear this shit in shrimp. He want his shiny shrimp. He ain't his shiny shrimp. He was my friend. Whenever I get lonely, and honey, honey, hi. He gave me his shoulder. It wasn't very nice. And honey, honey, hi. There is no other love of my life. You are my friend, love of my life. A cynic in I'm like, what the fuck did she just say? She ain't saying shit. We don't be paying attention to shit either when we listen to the music. Stevie Wonder, man, is one of my favorite artists. Yes. Lately, I've been staring in the mirror. Oh, yeah. Why the fuck is Stevie Wonder staring in the mirror? Y'all ain't pay attention to that shit. This nigga, this nigga ain't even seen his kids. He asked you on a song, isn't she lovely? This nigga just asking y'all a question. I'm gonna leave y'all with this, man. I gotta go. They were still killing black and brown people during COVID. Still killing us. But I'm gonna tell you one thing they didn't kill, and what I love about the LBGT community is that they stick together and they fight together. The police ain't killed one of them because they, they don't want them problems. They stick together. Listen, fellas, if you ain't gay, you better learn how to act gay when the police pull you the fuck over. <laughs> I got pulled over on my way over here. I'm from Oakland, California. I ain't got no license and registration. I'm a real nigga. Police pulled me over. I was scared because he had his hand on his gun. He asked me for my wallet. I said, it's in my glove department. Can you get it? Because I'm scared. He gets it. He go run back to check my license. That's when I got ready for his ass. You ain't about to kill me. came back, I was like, oh my God, you hella cute. <laughs> Look at that little gun you got. Pew, 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 pew. Hey, y'all, I'm Mario motherfucking Hines from California, man. Love y'all.